this video is all about concept definition application and examples of cam and followers hello friends i am sunil wadokar and i have created this video for better understanding of cam and followers its definition its concept and application so let's proceed to our video now first we take the definition of cam 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 is rotating machine element which gives reciprocating or oscillating motion to another element known as follower in simple language we can say that the cam and follower it is a mechanism which is used to convert the rotary motion into linear motion that is straight line motion the cam and follower have a line contact and thus it con constitutes a higher pair here in that figure you can watch the cam is moving and follower is is reciprocating reciprocating up and down then after that three elements in cam make cam and follower mechanism the three important elements in cam and follower mechanism are driver that is cam it is driver member and follower it is driven member and frame it is to support the cam and guide of the follower then after that applications applications of cam and followers internal combust internal combustion engine for exhaust valve then after that cams are also used in shoe making machine then sawing machine punching press then paper cutting machine then after that fuel pump or diesel engine cams are also used in feed mechanism of automatic lathe machine and some textile machineries cams have different shapes these are known as cam profiles now first we take pier shape in this figure we can see that the cam profile is pier in shape then heart shape so heart shape this type of cam is heart shaped cam then circular cam here the shape of the cam is in circular form then we move next to drop cam drop cam here the shape you can see in that diagram or figure then after that wedge cam in wedge cam wedge has translational movement that is linear movement the follower can translate or oscillate in this type of cam spring is used to maintain the contact between cam and follower as you can see in that figure so in the linear or wedge cam moves backward and forward in a reciprocating motion here in that figure you can see the mechanism of motion then after that radial cams here in this figure in two figures you can see that cam with knife edge follower it is a radial cam cam with spherical follower in radial cams the follower reciprocate or oscillates in the direction perpendicular to the cam axis now cylindrical cams cylindrical cams in cylindrical cams the follower reciprocates or oscillates in direction parallel to cam axis as you can see that the shape of the cam is in cylindrical form so we call this cam as cylindrical cam spiral cam here this figure 
that shows the spiral cam. Here groove is cut in form of spiral which guides the follower. Hello. Then after that end cam. It is similar to the cylindrical cam in which follower makes contact at periphery of cam. As you can see in that video, this type of cam is end cam. Then after that spherical cam, here the shape of cam is in spherical form and the groove is made on that spherical shape in which the follower glides or moves in constant motion. Then followers. The follower it is a component which is designed to move according to the shape of cam. It follows the edge of the cam. So it is called as follower. Classification of followers. Classification of follower it turns into three basic types. Then first according to the shape, then second according to the motion of follower, then third according to the path of the follower then different types of shapes of follower here we have knife edge follower that is the edge of that follower is like knife knife edge then in next figure we can see that flat foot follower is there here the shape is in flat type of follower then offset follower this type of follower it is offset that is it is having some distance as the y axis of follower and cam is separated by some distance we call this a, it is as offset follower then next roller follower roller follower in this figure we can say see that this follower on upper side it is its end is in roller shape so this follower is called as roller follower there is also one shape like spherical shape in this figure we you can see that here the space is spherical in shape of that follower it is spherical shape Then after that classification according to the motion of follower. It is done in two types. The oscillating follower and reciprocating, reciprocating follower. If the follower is oscillating then that motion is oscillating motion and the follower is moving up and down then it is reciprocating follower. Then third type and important type according to the path of motion of follower. Classification of follower according to the path of motion of follower. That is first it is radial follower. Here the axis of cam and axis of the follower it is same. Then after that second that is offset follower. Here the axis of cam is slightly separated by some distance to the axis of follower so we called this as offset follower in that figure you can see that now motion of the follower then what is race or outstroke the upward movement of the follower is called as race or outstroke then what is fall or return? Return stroke. The downward movement is called as fall or return stroke. Then after that what is dwell? When the follower is not moving upward or downward, even the cam rotates, it is called as dwell. Here are the some examples of the cam and followers 
in this first example it is exhaust wall of internal combustion engine so this figure is very good example we can see that cam and follower follower are operated as a wall then another example that is controlled movement of engine wall and this in this another image cam is used in pump we can see that this is also example of cam and follower so thank you for watching this video please like share and subscribe this this video thank you friends